Look, G-code is complicated, but it doesn't have to be rocket science. GWizard Editor makes it easy. Traditional G-code tools are focused on being power tools for G-code experts. They forgot to make G-code easier for people that don't work with G-code every day, day in and day out. They work, but they're not easy, they're not fun, and you have to be an expert all the time to use one. With GWizard Editor, we wanted to make G-code easy. We started with a clean sheet of paper and no preconceived notions about how the tool had to work. In fact, we wanted to bring a whole slew of new ideas to the table designed to make your G-code work easier. For starters, we made it visual because CNC is visual, right? You want to be able to see what's going on at all times, manipulate that view just as you would in your CAD software, be able to look at different perspectives of your part and understand visually what's going on every step of the way. The next thing we did was to add what we call hints. We wanted what can be very cryptic g-code to be explained in plain English. That's really easy to do in g-code editor. Go to any line, look at the uh, hint line over here, you'll see the g-code and we'll explain what each, what each different part of that g-code is doing for you. Here's the block or sequence number, here's a tool change, we're going to apply tool length compensation, and H is tool offset zero. Makes it easier when you can see every line of G-code expressed in straightforward English to tell you what it's doing. We added conversational CNC. This is a way, very visual, that lets you create G-code easily without CAD or CAM every time. If you just want to make a simple part, why fire up CAD or CAM? So, with conversational wizards, you can go in, select from our visual menu different common operations. These are all the things you're used to if you've ever done any manual machining. Let's say we want to make a slot. You answer the basic questions about the slot, hit insert, and GWizard Editor writes all the G-code for you. This is great for getting simple things done without the overhead of CAD CAM, but it's also a great learning tool and it's a great tool for adding features to your existing G-code programs. Maybe you left a hole out somewhere and you just need to add one very quickly and easily. We created a G-code simulator that tells you what's going on and most importantly it tells you what's wrong. So many G-code simulator products just show you the graphical backplot and you have to figure out what's going on from that. With our simulator you can run through, step at a line of G-code at a time, step at five at a time, uh, just turn it on and let it run and change the speed that it's going and see exactly what your G-code is going to do. You've got the hints, you can stop this at any point to look at the hints, but here's the thing that's really most powerful about it. It tells you what's wrong. Let's say I go into this arc, let's make it wrong. Uh, and I know it's an arc because it's telling me here in the hint. Uh, so I'm just going to change it so it's now way off. Now I get an error message telling me exactly what's going on there. The arc radius is too small to reach the end point of the arc. Pretty straightforward, right? We tell you what's wrong. There's a lot more features like that. There are guided tours online, there's video training, and of course there's CNC Cookbook's free G-Code tutorial course that's just filled with examples you can try in GWizard Editor. We're all about trying to make G-Code easier for you. The thing is, there have been tens of thousands of machinists who've used our software from over 2,000 different companies. Why not get started making G-Code easier today by signing up for our free 30-day trial of GWizard Editor. It's right below this video. Check it out. You'll like it.